Um, yeah, well, you know, my name is Kendrick Ellis. Um, originally from West Palm Beach, Florida. I was born in Jamaica, though. Um, you know, I went to Hampton University, where I spent three years, you know, just working my butt off, um, trying to be the best I could be at Hampton. Um, it means a lot, you know. It, this is just how it works. It pays off. That's all. You know, it took a lot of hard work to, to even make it to college, you know, and just a, a more hard work to be recognized for that. Right now, you know, I'm just trying to um, eventually, you know, one day become a starter here in NSA. So, you know, if I could get a starting job one day, that would be a, that'll mean a lot to me. Um, you know, it, it was just, just, just basically, you know, hustling to the ball. You know, one of them was a, a play like eight yards downfield, just hustling to the ball, you know, on a screen play. That's all. Just hustling to the ball takes care of most of the work sometimes. Um, this, it's a really beautiful city, man. I'm just blessed to be a part of the Jets franchise. It's a real nice city. It's real big and fast. Much bigger than West Palm Beach. I want to go to the Statue of Liberty, and that's about it so far. I've been real busy with camp. Um, I'm just uh, easy player to coach. You know, I take coaching really well, and I try to work my butt off. You know, just work really hard to get accomplish the goals for the team. I love winning, so I do whatever it takes to win. That's just drills are what I work on using my hands. You know, that's the major thing here in there, so you gotta be able to use your hands. So every defense and tackle is fine to make it to the next level. My only advice to them is make sure you run to the ball every play. It doesn't matter where the play is at, run to the ball, be in the camera angle at the end of the play. Um, just tune in, you know, it's me. And Marcus Dixon, he's another Hampton alumni on the team. You know, we're going to be on the team just, you know, working hard, trying to make our fans proud. You know, proud to be come from the HBCU. You know, the best, the best, the best thing I want to miss is just the bands, you know. At the HBCU, they take pride in the band. That's going to be the major difference, you know, just the band playing loud and the fans getting into the game. Um, you know, uh, I just do want to tell them I'm going to work really hard, you know, to uh, represent the franchise well and just be a good team player and just try to represent the organization well. Nah, I just watch, you know, I like to watch the news and play video games, man, like any person my age is probably do right now. I play, you know, FIFA, Madden, and a lot of Call of Duty. I have no talent or hobbies, man. I just play football. My mom always believed in me, and she pushed me, you know, to do everything I've done. And, you know, my high school coach has always been good. I still communicate with them to this day. You know, just my mom, just, you know, just just, just seeing her struggle, just trying to help her out, you know, just... That was my major motivation. Back in college, I thought I knew a lot, you know. Coming to the NFL made me realize I really knew nothing. It's like starting over again, you know. It made me calm down and want to learn a lot more about the game. I mean, my teammates, um, my teammates, Mike DeVito and Poa, you know, Puha, you know, they just really been very inspirational to me, you know. They just try to help me out the best they can and I just take from it and just try to build my skill, you know. Yeah, um, again, you're seeing the Kendrick Ellis, um, defense and tackle for the New York Jets, um, you know, Jet Nation stand up. We're going to try to do our best this year, and go Jets.